Well, I got offered a job in Germany. Oh, brilliant. Ah, no, I'm not gonna take it. You need to speak German. Well, we just learn it, it's easy. I did it in a week. What? Well, yeah, so many English words are German. You already know tons. Trust me. Really? Yeah. Hamster, Dachshund, Poodle, Rottweiler, Schnauzer. That'd be useful if I was gonna work in a pet shop. Kaput, Poltergeist, Doppelganger. Famously everyday words. Zeppelin. Yeah, I'm just gonna let them know I can't do it. So. What? No, 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 hold on. Look, you don't have to learn German. Yes, you do. No, you don't. You just have to learn Volensy. Volensy. It means do you want, okay. right? And then you just add an English word after, but you say it like you're drunk. Like I'm drunk? Yeah, yeah it's easy. What am I saying? Okay, Volensy, drinking. Do you want to drink? Yeah, pretty much. Uh, wollen Sie schwimmen? Do you want to go swimming? Yes! Wollen Sie learnen? Do you want to learn? Yeah! You try it. Wollen Sie dancing? Dancing, yeah? yeah? That's what I was saying. Oh, and get this, okay? Germans never make up a new word. They just take two old words and smush them together. Efficient. You already know the word for hand. Hand? And shoe? Shoe? So guess the word for glove. Hand shoe? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Deadly. Yeah. Descriptive. Efficient. German. Mm. There is some words you have to watch out for because the meanings are actually different. Okay, yeah. so a uh, billion means trillion. Okay. okay. Gift is poison. Yikes. Mm -hmm. And never work out in a gymnasium. Why not? Because it's actually a high school and it gets really weird very quickly. Wow, that's a big one. The German word for big is gross. Oh, brilliant. What is it? Oh, no, it's really gross. I don't mind. It's just a word. No, no, seriously, it is gross. You can tell me I'm not Honestly, squeamish. it's I don't. just gross. Okay, fine. Is there anything else you can tell me? Um, in, in German, they have, uh, they have three genders. That's pretty progressive. But you only have to learn the present tense. Why just the present tense? Well, you see, the future tense just it takes so long to say grammatically, and you can just forget about the past tense. Oh, right, is that because you shouldn't talk about the past with Germans? No, it's because there's two forms of the past tense and it's complicated. Perfect. And imperfect. You see, it's all there. It's so simple. These hacks are all well and good, but like they're only ever going to get me like 20 seconds into a conversation. That's perfect. No conversation's going to go longer than 20 seconds. After that, the Germans are just going to want to practice their English. That's true. Yeah? Just, you don't think I can, I can do this? <laughs> of course you can do this. Just watch out for some of the pronunciations, okay? Oh, yeah? So W sounds like V. V right. sounds like F. J is Y, Z is T, S. G is said like a hard G, unless it's at the end of the sentence, then it's K. If D is at the end of the sentence, it's T. S can be said S, Z, or SH. A is E, I is E, and Y is Upsilon. Oh, and there's 16 words for that. Right. Well, I guess I'll just learn all that when I'm there. <laughs> yeah, of course. Yeah? Just pick it up. Yeah. It's perfect. What's the job? A uh, German teacher. Doomed up. Vielen Dank, we are coming to Hamburg. Thank you very much. In Deutschland. We're coming to Hamburg in Germany. <laughs> Soon. Soon. Bald. <laughs> Bald. <laughs> Bald. Bald. And uh, we also have another European date in Denmark in Copenhagen. We're also touring the UK mm -hmm. this month. My favourite German word is Burgermeister. Yeah, it's good, isn't it? Burgermeister! <laughs> it's like, what is it? Master of burgers? <laughs> it's like a burger flavoured shot. It do not.